ultrasonography of benign vulva lesions. The vulva, also known as pudendum, refers to the external female genitalia. The vulva is a collective term for several anatomical structures, which includes the labia majora, labia minora, the mons pubis, the clitoris, the vestibule, and the batolins glands. We'll look at some benign vulva lesions and their sonographic features. The benign vulva lesions we'll be looking at there are the batolins gland cyst, batolins gland abscess, which is a complication of batolins gland cyst. We'll look at vulva lipoma, vulva epidermal cyst, vulva hemangioma, and vulva varices. We're going to look at the sonographic features of these benign vulva lesions. We'll be starting with batolins gland abscess. Bartholin glands abscess occurs as a result of complications or infection of a Bartholin gland cyst. The clinical presentation includes painful swelling at the labia majora, there is presence of fever, and there will be inflammation of the affected vulva side. The sonographic features of Bartholin glands abscess includes a hypoechoic cystic mass like we can see on the screen, with thick walls, the arrows are pointing at the septations, there will be irregular outline and internal echoes. There will be presence of sonographic fluctuations or acoustic streaming, that is movement of the purulent fluid collections seen within the Bartholin's gland abscess. On color doubler interrogation, there will be presence of peripheral vascularity. And due to the cystic content of the Bartholin gland abscess, there will be presence of posterior acoustic enhancement. This is the video demonstrating Bartholin's gland abscess. On color doubler interrogations, the walls, there's, the walls are vascular, there is presence of septations, the arrow here is pointing as at the acoustic streaming, the movement or sonographic fluctuations, which represent the movement of the purulent fluid. Next, we will be looking at uh, Bartholin gland cyst. Bartholin gland cyst is the most common cystic lesion of the vulva and it arises as a result of cystic dilatations of the Bartholin dot. The sonographic features include an anechoic to hypoechoic cystic mass with a well-defined cyst wall and due to the fluid content of the Bartholin gland cyst, there is presence of posterior acoustic enhancement. Here is the cyst in the video demonstrating Bartholin gland cyst. You can see the uterus, the urinary bladder, and then the well-defined cystic mass with posterior acoustic enhancement. The next is vulva lipoma. Vulva lipoma is a benign mesenchymal neoplasm that is well-defined, small, and painless. It closely resembles the pathology and presentation of any lipoma found in any part of the body. It is commonly found in young and middle-aged women. It is usually soft mobile and not adherent to the skin or the underlying structures. The sonographic features include a well-defined hyperechoic mass like we can see in this video, homogeneously hyperechoic mass which may be oval in shape and on color doubler interrogation, no flow is indicated. When physically examining a woman with vulva lipoma, you will see a bomb, a vulva bomb that is painless mobile on compression and very soft on palpation. Sonographic features remain the homogeneously hyperechoic mass without flow on color doubler interrogation. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe to follow up the part 2 of this lecture where we will be discussing the vulva epidermal cyst, vulva varices and vulva hemangioma.